Beatrice, what's wrong? <laughs> Two things. Firstly, my cold sores are totally acting up what? again. What? Ew, gross. Secondly, Mr. Hattrick saw me writing in my diary during class, and he took it and he locked it in his desk. And he says he's going to give it to the principal tomorrow. If anyone sees what's in there, I will just die. It's really personal. Yeah, well, nothing like having the whole school know your deepest secrets. Makes your teenage years go by in a flash. Yeah, well, you'll soon find out. Me? Why? In the diary, I talk a lot about you and me. What? There is no you and me. Yeah, yeah, there is. See, first you rescued my notes from Mandy, and then we fell in love, and oh, you brought me flowers, what? and wrote me poetry, and showed this kinder, sensitive side that soon the whole world is going to know about. We're like doomed lovers. Enough. Okay, I'll get your book back. Then we can kiss. The cold sores aren't contagious once they start to scab over. kids into submission. Well, what have you tried so far? Random violence, widespread destruction, gratuitous sadism. No, no, that's not gonna work. They get all that kind of stuff at home. Now what you gotta do is you gotta beat one of them publicly. You gotta prove to them you're better than their best man. Why don't you box that dumb jerk Biff? Not bad, Pete. Not bad at all. All right, see you around. Wait, Jimmy, can I come too? You know what, don't worry about it. man win. And then you little trust fund fairies will know what life is all about. Anytime, Popper. Of course. The best man always wins. Me. Come on. Afterwards, you can clean my shoes. A sight. Oh, how very amusing. 
They picked a fight with me, and I showed them who was boss. And Gary got them to pick that fight, so maybe you'll show him as well. Gary's an even bigger problem. He'll have to wait. Hey! What's this throwback want? A haircut? A nice strong man to cuddle up to? Who knows? Jimmy Hopkins, right? My friend Johnny needs your help. Then tell your friend Johnny to come and ask for it. Nobody tells Johnny anything. Johnny Vincent does the telling. Well, he doesn't tell me what to do. Now beat it, greaseball. You're causing an oil slick. I said he needs your help, man. Do I look like a charity service? You're gonna pay for this. What is wrong with this place? Everyone here either needs help, wants to beat you up, or both. Well, you know who Johnny Vincent is, though, don't you? No, and I don't care. He's head of the greaser clique. Get friendly with him, and he could help you get to Gary. Yeah, maybe. Tell you something, Pete. This place blows. Tell me about it.